Throughout the nations of Europe, men and machines combine and compete to determine year by year who are to be the champions on two wheels. Motorcycling provides a whole spectrum of skills and excitement in widely differing events. This film looks at just four of them. First of all, Holland and motocross, March 72. A festive welcome to St. Anthony's, where the circuit borders the village itself. This meeting, the second leg of the Lent Trophy, is traditionally one of the first times that riders competing for the World Championships gather to see what developments their rivals have made during the winter. Naturally, there's a strong Dutch entry here. From Germany, Adolf Wiel and Willy Bauer. Hot favourite from Belgium, Sylvian Gabors. The Swedes, his main challengers. Here from Britain, John Banks and Andy Robertson. So, with this strong international field, it's not surprising that a crowd of 40,000 is attracted to this meeting. The riders are ready, but not the gate marshal. That's better. And 30 of Europe's top motocross aces roar away to do battle. wide starting straight funnels into a tight bend, causing a few anxious moments. Into the woods, it's local boy Volsink from Chris Hammergren, Gibbors, and the rest in hot pursuit. the woods, Hammergren takes Volsink, with Gibbs just behind and leading the pack. The loose sandy surface soon becomes very rutted and the riders get a real hammering. There'll be some very tired arms before this afternoon is through. The second lap. And it's still Hammergren who leads Volsink and Gabors into the woods. Now Gabors has squeezed through into second spot and is pressing Hammergren. Suzuki chasing Yamaha. How strange that would have sounded in motocross only a couple of years earlier. And Gabors is through. He passes Hammergren at the exit to the woods and starts to pull away. Behind these two, a duel has developed between Bengt Aberg and Dutch rider Pierre Karsmarkers. Karsmarkers is already showing the form that has made him national champion. And it's easy to see whose side the crowd are on. Jack van Felthoven on his works Yamaha has moved up to fifth place after a poor start. John Banks tastes the dust from De Ruver as he battles for tenth position. Andy Robertson. still leading, but to the crowd's delight, Karsmarkus has passed Aberg and is now challenging Hammergren for second position. Not only does he challenge, he passes and begins to pull away. But behind, Van Velthoven is rapidly closing on the leaders.
Meanwhile, Gibbors starts his last lap with a lead of 16 seconds. A great ride by the Suzuki Ace. But as the crowd waits to cheer his victory, Kibbos stops, only 300 yards from the finish, and Van Felthoven, who's just passed Karsmarkers, can't believe his luck as he roars past to take the chequered flag for the second leg. Karsmarkers crosses just behind, but grasps overall victory in the Lent Trophy with his first leg performance. And here comes poor Gibbs, urged on by officials and crowd. But six other riders flash past him before the finish line. Karsmarkers acknowledges the cheers of the crowd. But it's Gibbs who gets the sympathy. A broken piston is to blame. But Sylvian accepts defeat in the manner of a true champion. <laughs>